What's going on guys and welcome back to another Cyberpunk 2077 video. We are continuing on from last time which was a shorter video which was basically us planning on how we are going to infiltrate this industrial plant down here. Obviously I am still live over on Twitch hence why you can still see Twitch chat down here. So if I respond to somebody in chat you might see who responded or what questions they asked. So you have a bit of context and you don't just have me just looking away and responding and talking to nobody so welcome back good morning good afternoon and good evening welcome back to the uh, the channel we're going to continue on because we're following i forgot his name it's been over 12 hours since i played and i forgot his name takamura takamura that's it we're following takamura uh two I think we're going to take over this plant now. You ready? So I'm guessing I'm going to go and infiltrate this because I forgot what was going in here for. Why are you staring at me like that? Got me knife, got me stubby stubby. That's all we need. So I've just been responding. So as of me playing this part, episode seven, eight have just been released, and I've been responding to your guys' comments here, especially here on YouTube. Um You're trying to give me advice and stuff, but like I'm like episode well, this is like episode 18 now we're recording. So I'll be in touch. I'm a way ahead. Well, I think some of you have been commenting. Are you just going to do story quests? Are you going to do side quests? And what's the plan with the series? Oh, oh! I'm actually going to break in now. Okay. Hey. God, this game is beautiful. Where did that van go? So we've got multiple options. We can either take the bridge and take them guards. We can climb up here. Or we could possibly try and get into a vehicle and get in. Break into arrows like I was, and then. The world is our oyster. Look at that big guy. Arasaka Mech. Weak to electricity. Resistance to fire and hacking. I'm guessing there's multiple vehicles that come this way. What was that? Is that another one there? Yeah, so these are ones we can actually steal. I think I might just jump over. I think that might be my plan. Maybe over the wall. There's a cop right here as well. Evening off, is it? guy nearly saw me. Right, so we need to try and get inside the warehouse. One thing I've got to watch out for is security cameras. 
and possible snipers. So we can see the cameras up on the map here. We've got to look out for sharpshooters and stuffs. And the mech. And a warehouse outside town. You'll have to make do, and the children will have to make do with a school we can afford. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. I am like a cat. I just pounce. But he's going to come back this way. We've got a camera here as well. Oh, shit. There was a gap there. Uh. Holy moly. That's bulletproof glass. Reloading. Okay. This is what we're doing now, is it? Regroup. Hide behind these boxes. Everything is fine. Take him from all sides. Got it. Ah. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is now awkward. Bloody he packs a punch. Surround him. I'll cut him off. I'll blow you to pieces. He has no right to leave. Oh, no excuse me. Ah. Perfect smoke grenade. This is for you. I'll blow you to pieces. Eat, please, finish him off. Bloody hell! Get off that! Let's 
Flipping lights, man. I'll blow you to pieces. Enemy contact. Oh, my God. This was meant to be a sneaky, sneaky mission. But I screwed that up. I thought it was going to be a lot closer than that. Do you want? Shut up. That was a little crazy. Concentrate your mind. What is my knife throw? Okay, throws pretty far. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so glad I got that bloody armor. Oh, there was a bit of a drop on it, though. chaotic that was just chaotic that was just sorry turrets to them okay i'm in i'm the largest float 
Clear control from inside. Contact. Check. Clear ordinary terminal. Gotcha. How's things at your end? Good. I will reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. Let's turn the surveillance off. <laughs> we'll turn it off now. I keep pressing escape to always leave them. But we're already in here. Oh, I can't even get in that. The thing is, though, because I've not been in that much combat, we've not really done much, but I'm, tr I'm just trying to link my knife skills to my blade skills to maneuverability. And it's just going to take time to get used to, isn't it? my knives. They're pretty powerful. Ugh. Not climb up there. I don't think I hit him in the head. Don't I have dash in mid-air now as well? I wish it changed to my blade straight after that, you know? It's a, it's a smoke grenade. I just gotta keep using what I'm doing and get better at it. And I'll become ninja. Woo. Okay. Floats are to do with as we please. Fly to Tokyo if you want. Haha. <laughs> I just may do that. Good work. Now it is. Who's tracing my location? Can you see? Terrible chaos. Even the roof is slowly. Me, the roof. That is your way up. There are buildings around. Smaller ones. Use them to come down. D, you must hurry. I'm out of like a approaches. Wait, what? Please hold. I got loading to do.
Um. Why did that come up? Ah. Right in the head. Because I'm pressing crouch to use the the things and the crouch is control now. I need to change my crouch to something. That's what I need to do. Because going to control... Wait, I could just use C. Yeah, okay. Now. now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not <laughs> to get into any more trouble. As if I wasn't in enough already. Wait, can I? No, I can't dash in mid-air yet. That's what I need, is I need jump, dash, kind of thing. But I've just got myself a couple of uh, skill points. That was a little messy, but I could see the potential with my build. Know what I mean? Um, I need more blades. Only effective throwable weapons. Recovery time. I need... Because I like the knives. And I definitely like throwing them. Recovery time for throwable weapons. I feel like we need to go for you. That's what we need. Apply a poison. Plus 15 uh, health on crit hits and headshots with throwable weapons. Mm. All right, let's get recovery time. Crit hits, headshots... And hits to weak spots with throwable weapons apply poison for five seconds. Okay, so we're doing that. But we also want the juggler. Instant cooldown reset for all throwable weapons after neutralizing an enemy with a throwable weapon via a headshot, crit hit, or a poison. So at least I can, like, throw more. So maybe we put the cool up. But I also want to look into the Mantis Blades additional stuff as well. Got one skill point, which if we go into here, where's the dash? We want this, right? Unlocks a blade finisher. Press F when an enemy's health is low. Stamina cost. Let's get that. Because then we have this sword up here, don't we? Da -da. Allows you to shoot while dashing. We're going full ninja. That was fun, though. It was, like I said, it was chaotic. I. Oh. I just put my knife away. Sorry. I was just cutting a, some lettuce. Um, but yeah, I could definitely see the potential with my build. I definitely like. Like in most games, like playing fast anyway. It's just getting used to the keybinds and just switching to my throwable, to my melee. And then also, when I do throw my knife, it switches straight to my sniper. I don't think I want that. I think I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch the sniper rifle into a different slot and get a shotgun there instead. I think it makes more sense for me to... If I throw my knife, it instantly switches to a shotgun because I'm going to be close range anyway for a ba bam kind of thing. And the blood on the lettuce is that you're... Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. So... Uh, Discord sounds. We don't like them. Um, but what do we want to look at here now because we're obviously we're still pursue other leads while waiting for takamura to get ready so we got dog eat dog which is the dog town border the gift uh i fought the law meet with elizabeth perales i fought the law on the law one let's do that meet with elizabeth perales i think that's something new um maybe before we go there actually is we go and do a bit of selling. Let's get the Ripper Dock off here and go and sell some items. Because we need to make the money.
Uh, oh, Takamu has already messaged me. What did he have to say? Uh, about what we discussed on the roof, Lacano can take a human appearance sometimes. They even consume their owner and replace them. Keep it as a warning. Just an image, no nuggets of Bushido wisdom. Uh, not every fool is a thief, but every thief is a fool. Takamura Goro 2077. What would you say to a little dinner together? A real one. What's the longer would you say? Regina Jones. V, got a fight at construction site. Dude responsible is heavily ironed. Heard something about lasers. If you manage to get him alive, be a great study candidate sending you the deets. One of the workers went psycho, started smashing up the construction site. Seems some of the workers tried to stop him, but their little poorly one shots couldn't pierce the exoskeleton of his anyway. They either ran into or got into construction. If you could catch my drift, go check it out for me. Okay. Reconnaissance. I am waiting by the construction site. If wait, we've already done that. Uh, first will be the Grey Batmos Collective. This is just that random message I keep getting. El Capitan and Razors. Um, store. Time to sell. Time to sell. What the hell? Tier three pistol. It's the one I'm currently using. Tier two iconic. I'm definitely going to keep it and probably store it. It, it is lower, but look at that revolver. Sixty three damage. Thirty four damage. Reload speed is high. Reload speed on that is high. Weapon handling, 380. 672. Attack speed, 364. Hmm. Let me check here. Because obviously I want to change this, right, to possibly a shotgun. We only have the one shotgun here. Unless we look at getting a shotgun. Or I could get the submachine gun as the, the weapon. Maybe I switch it to that just for now. But then this precision rifle is pretty decent. Maybe we'll go for that for now. So it's, hmm, unless I get rid of that and then bring it in for the, the SR. I think that's something, right? It's just something for range. And then let's just sell the precision rifle, the pistol, the revolver, the assault rifle, and the double barrel shotgun. Get rid of them. One handed club. That's the, the one we got from Thingy, isn't it? From that bed. Okay. So on these... Pretty sure I can... Oh, yeah, attachments. Here we go. Uh, crit chance, recoil, but crit chance is low. Recoil angle reduction. Tier 2, tier 2, tier 2. The sniper rifle, we can't do any mods to that. The knife, I don't think we can do any mods to them. Okay, so that's that done. Next up, we have 14,000. Not much at all. I'm thinking we just go and do this job now. Excuse me. So this is me, Elizabeth Perales, and she's 1.7 kilometers away. Oh, that's the second amendment. Let's look into it. All right, so we've just arrived at a weapon store. I thought we might nip in and see if there's any goodies for us. Hello. Thinking of buying some iron. You're thinking sound. Won't get far in Night City without any. What have you got? Everything's out of our, <laughs> our budget. <laughs> How much? 27, 50. <laughs> okay. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Let's get back on the road and go and see Elizabeth. Okay, so she's just up, up, up here on the uh, right-hand side somewhere. In here. Oh, I can't drive in there. Oh, it just forced me out my own car. I've kind of noticed that with some, like, mission areas or, like, like, little, like, the camp and, like, some areas, you can't drive the car too close. It kind of puts you in, like, an invisible wall and throws you out sometimes, or it, it makes you look like your vehicle's dying. Hello. Are you V? Please step in the vehicle. Uh, okay. Okay. Hello, V. I'm Jefferson Perales. Hi. You've already spoken with Elizabeth, my wife. Okay. Nice to meet you, Mr. Perales. Mrs. Perales. Hmm, right again, Liz. You see, my wife is a great judge of character. Okay. Said so this would work. Now I see why. I'm not going to lie. If this is some form of 
three-way you wanted to do here? Um, I don't. I'm not interested. Is everything all right? Yeah, but I'm interested so, in the job. What do you got for me, Carter? Let's go. Elizabeth. Well, as you're probably aware, Mayor Lucius Ryan recently passed. Okay. We want to know how, why, whatever else is pertinent. It was all over the news. Of course it was. Media feasted for weeks. Pieces like that are their lifeblood. Right. Think they missed something? We have reason to believe they did, yes. As far as I know, case is closed already. It is. Of course, the police wrote it off as natural causes. Ryan passed at home due to a cardio implant malfunction. But we're left wondering about the cyber psycho attack at City Hall a few days earlier. Mm -hmm. The police say it was completely unrelated. These suspicions of yours wouldn't have anything to do with the upcoming election, would they? Mm -hmm. Of course they would. If Lucius Ryan was murdered, we want to know. Need to know. What makes you think the cops got it wrong? Got any evidence? Shortly before Ryan passed, he made cuts in the NCPD budget. Perhaps got on someone's bad side that way. In any case, we have the cyber psycho attack on a BD. Our chief of security scanned it, but didn't find anything out of the ordinary, so to speak. We need a brain dance editor, a real one. It's raw footage. The brain dance. It has to be back where it belongs today. Or a lot of people will be in a lot of trouble. Do you want me to brain dance? If you agree to help, you can see it right now. Where'd you get the scroll? Ryan was making a public appearance. BD scrolling standard procedure for events like that. Following the attack, the NCPD impounded the footage as evidence. We had to pull many strings to extract it. All right. See what I can do. Excellent. We'd be happy with any find that would clarify things. Alleviate lingering doubts. Right. Time to blind me. What are we looking at? Well, what do we got here? Question is, what are you doing here? My brain too, isn't it? Yeah. And this time, don't go scrolling every ass you see. Let's just watch the whole Eyes thing. on the mayor. Stuff belongs to City Hall. Let's make it PG. Very sus behavior. Who's this guy coming in? Hold it! Stop right there! How did he get that far in? Slow your roll! Re reward, NCPD. Uh huh. Police. Let him in? Let him wait. It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Cream, do it after the conference. Whoa! Damn! All right, let's rewind to the beginning. And this time, don't. Let's uh, go into editing mode. Who's scrolling every ass you see? I am there. Step along to the hole. Let me be. Who's the Hulk guy? No idea. Those ass clowns are all the same. Um. Second conference in three days. No idea what this blitz is for. That's why I'm mayor and you're not. Now's when we need the visibility. 
You're spreading yourself too thin. I'll rest tonight. My room at the Red Queen's race is ready. Yes, of course. Good. Now go. Out of practice. Red Queen's race? Cause any inner synapse zaps? Sure, a bunch of old Brit farts and powdered wigs shouting, Off with their heads! You know, you're allowed to say you don't have a clue. They left literally seconds before the attack. And it looks planned. Like it was done on purpose. I mean, that or the psycho saw his chance and took it. Don't get paranoid on me. They oh. knew what was happening. Gotta practice. Slow your roll. Re reward NCPD. Police. Let him in. Let him wait. It's important. Gotta speak to the mayor's chief of security. Oh, yeah, here comes that guy. The, conference. the cop wanted to tell security something. Probably that he was standing by to lick Ryan's butthole. Terminal crashed right as he went through the gate. Yeah, glitch was no accident. Nah, seen stranger coincidences. Like? Like when you bang some chick and then her sister later, same night. <laughs> and it turns out they're both sisters of God. That really happened to you. <laughs> No, but it could have. Scum? Prime, do it after the conference. The tune, don't recognize it. Tune. What he's humming. Wouldn't call that a tune. He's really into it. Could have chromed half the city with what he was packing. Probably what happened. Body disappeared from the morgue, sight unseen. And then some pig got himself a new set of wheels and an ugly ass suit. Know that? He's just We're a full look at his feet. Again. Uh, he's a full Once on like, seen all droid. Seen, don't need to know things to know him. People are the same everywhere. Okay, it's coming at your ass. Well, well, well. It's like that cop knew it was happening, gonna happen, because obviously he it crashed when he went through it and everything. Thoughts? Did I wonder why I was so short then? Rather not jump to any conclusions. There's not much to go on. Still too early to say. Sure, sure. Any questions at this point? Red Queen's race. What is it? Got me. Never heard of it. Sorry. Who's Holt? Ryan's deputy, and his bulldog, so to speak. Running in Ryan's place now. Conference. Why was it held? For no particular reason. Ryan liked the sound of his voice and seeing himself on TV. <laughs> yeah, that sort of thing. As far as I recall, the drop at Night City's violent crime rate was the excuse for this one. Ryan came out to tout it. <laughs> Sorry, drop. Ryan reclassified Pacifica an independent district. Stats for that part of town stopped counting. <laughs> Clever. Cop who saved Ryan. Know anything about him? Detective River Ward. Good guy. We worked a few cases together. You want to talk to him? I'll put you in touch. Mayor's Hustle. The NCPD? No. All handpicked by Holt. And on a corpse payroll. But there are ex-cops among them. 
Anyone else besides Ryan's detail have access to the terminal? Hmm. NCPD. That's it. Sheesh. Ward had great timing. Either has crazy good luck or had a source. Got good info. I'm gonna need some of each. Well said. Sending you his deeds. If you need anything else, let us know. We'll help. These have money. Call Detective Ward. This is Ward. Who am I talking to? Name's V. Looking into the death of one Lucius Rhine. Wonder why? You're not a cop. <laughs> Listen, I know you tried to warn Ryan about the cyber cycle. What else do you know? Now that you best meet with me. All right. I'm headed to Chubby Buffaloes. Be their stat. Chubby Buffaloes. What a name. All right, let's go see what this guy has to say. And why he tried to warn the mayor. Here it is. Chubby Buffalo's Boy BQ. Seventy percent real blood dripping meat. Slaughterhouse. Satisfy you. Someone here to see you, looks like. Oh, wonder mm -hmm. what about. Um, you River Ward. In the flesh. V, right? My partner, Detective Hun. Okay. Thanks for agreeing to meet. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. For now, I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? Boss already told you to drop it. I can say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice, as your friend. Let the case go. You see me do anything? Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be part of this. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner. Wouldn't want to be overheard. Okay. Talk. For the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. Get some info to them. What was it? Let me ask you a question first. Why do you got your nose in this? Who hired you? Sorry, never give up the names of my clients. Well then, I'm sure you've got plenty of other leads besides me. I mean, I sure hope so, cause I'm not telling you a thing. And I'm not being mean or nosy, nor is it personal. Just covering my own ass. My own safety's at stake too. So, before I open my mouth, I need to know whose ears are listening. Liz Perales hired me, and her husband, Jefferson. The presumed future mayor. <laughs> Guess I could have seen that coming. You know what? Han was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Music is shit, though. Okay, sure. I don't know what that music is, but... Like, it's very uh, anime. Oh boy, he's got a big boy vehicle. A Thornton. Some of the boys from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters. Hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. They took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. So you saw him as a potential threat, decided to warn the mayor. Just like that. Because you got a good heart. 
make it sound like that's something to be ashamed of. Shamed? Nah. Just not something you see every day. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. Before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. Hmm. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial? It's political, isn't it? As I see it, Perales is out to smear Holt. So he thinks Holt's involved? Then no, but even if he's not, the murdered mayor isn't great optics for his deputy. Perales could just be scared. Doesn't want the job of a guy who just got carried out feet first? <laughs> who would? Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. It got anything to do with Ryan? The guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. All I've heard is some fancy ass club. No idea where to even look for it. See, I might know. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Or actually, we could see her first. Up to you. I'm sorry. We? Can't shake this case. Something's up. Just look how quickly it was closed. This way, you can get your job done while I find evidence that gets my chief to reopen the case. Win win. So, where to first? Let's meet with the CI. Let's go see your informer. Club's a better lead. Fine with me. Wait, what just happened? What just happened? I fell My in the guy works here. I just fell in the back you seat. Go talk to him. I'll wait outside. What? Tell him Igor says hi. He'll know what it's about. All right. Wait here then. What just happened then? That was weird. Oh god, where are you taking me? Oh boy. Fantastic. For, uh, general inspiration or something specific? Because I can help with both. Looking for a club. Red Queen's race? If I was you. I try somewhere a little more welcoming. Lizzie's over in Kabuki is a good start. Or Clouds in Japantown. Want an address. Look, club's invitation only, right? You don't know the address. It means you're not welcome. Igor says hi. Fuck no. Said I was done. I was out. Yo, Wait. yo, yo, my chubers, what the? chubers and humans. Hey! Mr. Whitey here. Fuck alone. All of you. To the nearest door for a taste of sweet, 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 clean speed. What do you mean, like cheers, the informant? Short, to be slow. Don't make it. Their smoke is hot. Fuck. Hey, Neil. Piss off. Relax. What is that hairstyle? I've got one question to ask you. Nothing to see here, sir. Come on, ghost, I said. Back up. Leave me alone, got it? Can't make me do a damn thing. We can, actually, and we will. Just tell us where to find Red Queen's race. I don't know. So fucking remember. <laughs> and make it quick. All right. Jesus. Chill, okay? It's outside city limits, near the river, Benita Street area. You been there? Never. Not telling you another fucking thing. Benita Kiss Street. Kiss my ass, both of you. Can I get a discount? Well, well I might need it in the future. That's what I call a breakthrough. It seems promising, but I'd still hit that market. Market? Orvath's employer, one I mentioned before. I just wouldn't let that lead drop. Okay, let's go see this market of yours. We're gonna take my car? Sure, thanks. Right, so I'm gonna take his car and we're gonna get in River's car. And then we're gonna go and check out this next place, right? <laughs> 